All right, guys, I got a super cool video today. Um, I had to show you this tip because I thought I had two bad lithium batteries. So I bought this battery about a year or so ago and through a wiring mishap, it got drained all the way to nothing. So it's like showing one volt or something like that, which probably isn't even accurate. So um, I kind of researched it a little bit at the time and basically it said, if your battery gets drained too low, it won't charge. And I would take the standard charger and hook it up and nothing, it wouldn't even respond. I'd also take a real low voltage charger and it wouldn't do anything either. So I bought this new battery, put it in an RV, because I had upgraded our uh, camper from a uh, lead acid battery to a lithium battery. And so I put this battery in. Well, I must have a parasitic draw or something, and it drew this one down super low as well. So I thought, I'm gonna have to buy another battery for this thing. But I saw a little tip on YouTube, and I'll link the guy in the description, but he gave like three options of ways you can jumpstart these batteries. What happens is, is if it gets too low in voltage, there's a circuit board in here that will not allow it to charge if it doesn't have any voltage. So you have to kind of jumpstart it. So I actually got this one charged up by using my jump pack for my car. It's just a little um, Volkman uh, charger, which I'll also link that in the description because it is a rock star. But anyway, so I hooked it up like this and then I just took my clamps for my jump starter and just touched it to there and it started my charger charging and it charged all the way up. So what I'm gonna do today is another option. You take a good battery that's charged, which this one is now charged, and I'm gonna hook my these little clamps to the charger clamps. And we're gonna bump the voltage up to at least 12 volts off of this battery and it will let the charger start charging. Well, this will let the charger start charging. So I gotta make sure I touch the right side to the right side. And I'm gonna try to get out of the way so you can see. It's a zero, zero. I'm gonna just touch these for just a minute. And now it started charging. This read enough voltage that it said it was safe to charge and now my charger, standard automotive charger, will charge this up, just like that one. You don't have to buy a new battery if this happens. You just have to jumpstart your lithium battery. Crazy tip.